Well, tonight, a Tulsa charity celebrating a major milestone nearly two decades in the making. Filling the Void's tagline is, We Feed the Soul, and they've been serving meals to homeless and struggling Tulsans since 2003. Two News Oklahoma reporter Tony Russell is here in the studio tonight. And Tony, how many meals have they served? Karen, how about this? A quarter of a million. It's hard to imagine. You know, one hand, you're amazed by the charity's commitment, and on the other, you're reminded how many people are needing a hot meal. The number is 29. At the Tulsa Day Center, it's dinner time. And on this night, filling the void is feeding homeless Tulsans. When you start out, you never think about the milestones. And so when we started out, it was always just about going out the next week and going out the next week. And, and then the milestones started racking up. A milestone nearly 20 years in the making. There's, there's excitement, but there's also just a great sense of responsibility. We persisted for 20 years. We haven't stopped and we're not going to stop. We know that there are always going to be people in need. And so long as the need is there, we're going to be out meeting people exactly where they're at and encouraging them and giving them a message of hope. The charity marking 250,000 meals served to those in need. And so Rex, Congratulations. We are so excited for you. It's a great honor. The idea of it is just fantastic to think we've served 250,000. That's just awesome. Karen Rose volunteered nearly two decades ago. Kelly approached me one day with this idea that he had for serving the homeless, and I just fell in love with it immediately, and I've done it ever since. And now more than ever, a meal on a cold night goes a long way. It just kind of it just touches your heart to think that we've done this, we've lasted this long. I mean, we could have failed early on, but our hearts are everybody that works this ministry. We have some very faithful volunteers, and they love what, everybody loves what they do. Karen reported on this last week, but it's very important to note, you know, Tulsa Housing Solutions, they do this head count about month to month. And in November alone, they counted about 2,000 people needing services related to homelessness just in the Tulsa area alone. So it's, it's pretty alarming considering the cold front that we've got coming in. Yeah, and Kelly Swan, who you just saw in the story, he gave us a, a you know a couple of notes here. Homelessness, obviously, it doesn't go away, but because of the cold, that is something that is that could be fatal to some people that are out in the cold right now, and uh, especially with what's going to come in the next 48 hours, it is. He just wants to remind everyone to think and seek shelter and start thinking about that now. Absolutely, and hopefully they will seek the shelter that is available. All right, Tony Russell, thank you so much.